With just under 5,000 sailors aboard, USS Ronald Reagan arrived in Guam for a port call September 24. The carrier made its way to Guam from its home port of Yokosuka, Japan, to participate in Valiant Shield 2018, a U.S.-only biennial training exercise. According to Ronald Reagan weapons officer Commander Ivan Borja, Valiant Shield contributes to the readiness of the military as a whole, especially as the exercise is conducted in the Pacific region. It's a complex environment where we have to be at the top of our game for the, for the training and the support of what we do as a military. We gotta be flexible at all times to execute the mission. Valiant Shield is always good because we know when we do Valiant Shield, I know I'm coming to Guam. It's always great to be on Guam. Always great to be back home. Making a special visit back to the island were approximately 20 sailors with roots in Guam and the Commonwealth of the Northern Mariana Islands. For aviation support equipment technician Airman Michaela Duenas, this port call is a chance to not only indulge in her favorite local food and activities, but to spend some long-awaited time with family. It feels good. It's a blessing to be able to come home on deployment. Uh, I'm going to go swimming, I'm going to eat, go shopping, just enjoy my time back home. Leila Villagomez, Duenas' mother, expressed her excitement for her daughter to be home, as well as how proud she is of her daughter's service to the country. Oh, I saw her earlier this year, but this is the first time to see her get off her ship and see where she spends a lot of her time and work, so it's very uh, touching today. We're just very proud of her. Amid the ongoing exercise, Duenas believes the sailors' presence in the region is important. We're like forward deployed, so if anything happens, we're first on the scene. For Joint Region Marianas, I'm Moana Chargulov.